Here, see what kind of mic show we got. I put some apple bar in there last week. Oh, I don't know the bees in there. Holy moly. Wow, that's a lot of bees. You guys see that? Where's the hydro? <laughs> idea. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> See the apple bar. Split this hive. Maybe I'll do it right now. There we go. Just curious to see what kind of mice we got. Dead on the bottom board. Sometimes they'll clean them out though. Sometimes they clean them up though. That's probably what's going on. So, pause this. All right, so we're gonna split it. We've got ants that's living underneath there, so I'm gonna lift this up off the ground a little bit, just for now. It's a double hive. So. That'd be a good one for her to lay on, you know, ain't much in it. I'm gonna grab a couple honey frames, I'll be right back. Alrighty, got a couple honey frames, been saving up. You know, I robbed all the honey out of that hybrid. Anyway, you wanna put the honey frame against the divider. 
as they eat it, the queen will start laying. They're, they want to move together and become one cluster, even though they're separated. Oh, need some brood frame. Somewhere. I know I'll split this thing forward, actually. It's looking just full of larva. I think we're gonna put that in. It's almost like this tie recleaned itself or something, because where the heck's all the. Ow! Damn! There, now you're gonna sting me. Unless you need a little smoke on the situation. Yeah, this hive, I think, we cleaned it so I'm not seeing much of a sealed brood. A lot of larva. That's all larva. It's all larva. Now there's the queen. White queen. Got a terrible paint job. <laughs> anyway. We will put her right out here. Oh. Ow. Okay, so there's another. That one's got some brood on it. That'll all be hatching here soon. Let's put that right in the center. Nice looking pollen for him. Got some nice looking larva on it too, so that'll work. Hopefully that stuff is still. Yeah, we'll move that over a little bit. Doesn't need to be tight. Plenty of room. I could fit five frames in there, but that makes it hard to do anything. It's pretty tight. So I just want four. Generally. Sometimes five. Ah, see that gap ain't gonna work. I'm gonna need a strip of. A little bit of warpage, so we will lay that right there. That'll seal that up pretty good, hopefully. Should. Yeah. Well, that'll change. Oh, we need to get a queen. Uh -oh. Shoot, where are the queens at? I think they're banked, right?
Look at that. I got a queen. Marked yellow. So what's up here right down in here? Look at it like that. Apple bar, queen. This one's got a queen. And a bee queen. I'm gonna put this one up over here. We'll put some weight on it. Let it, let it be Nothing. A little bit of a lot of pollen. Yeah, yeah, a lot of pollen on that one. That's a good one. Look at that. These are being pretty friendly. I'll show you why here in a second. <laughs> Out here in shorts. Up in the evening. You make these double highs, you want that divider to be like a piece of three-quarter board, what you want. Ah, you're gonna have problems like this. A little bit of plywood ain't enough. I'm gonna need to make them a little bit wider. Give him a blank, somewhere to draw. Got a little bit of weight to it. Oh, got a little bit of honey on it. That's good. Quite a few bees in there. I'm surprised they didn't make more honey, but this was the other hive that didn't do that great for honey wise. Anyway. Yeah, look at that fresh nectar coming in. If you looked at that, it's probably green. I know. Loose strife, purple loose strife nectar is, is uh, green. It looks like antifreeze, really. I ended up putting the three boxes on this extra. I'll do with these. I got a nuke out there. Got a nuke out there. I want to boost. All right, so we'll go with that. So what do we need on top? We need a piece of foam.
This is what we got left, but I know what I'm going to do with it. I sold a queen out of here. That big old humongous ragweed plant. <laughs> yeah. This is where I wanted to go. I'm gonna make a quick little nuke. Oh, what's left here? Oh, what's left? second look no wonder I got stung look at them dang things there's a huge yellow jacket nest down in there that is not good I'd rather get stung by 30 honeybees than one yellow jacket I gotta kill them damn things somehow night mission I don't know I hope I can slip these into that nuke without getting stung up anymore. That hurts. I just sold the queen out of this. Nice little brood pattern. It wasn't in there right long. Enough to make some brood, I guess. Wow, there's a lot of yellow jackets in there. Woo, mama. Ow, dang it. Ah, oh, they're getting me. That's a yellow jacket, dang it. That hurts. Woo. I just want to finish what I'm doing here. Too violent. <laughs> well, I gotta let that settle down there. Yeah, they got me good, got me on my hand. Oh my goodness. It's bad. I know how to take care of them though. Okay. After about eight yellow jacket stings, decided. <laughs> We got the tempo, tempo dust, wasp ant, whatever. This stuff is awesome. Can't buy it at the store. You got to order it online. But... Yeah, that'll be the end of that. In a few minutes. Oh, there's a nice honey frame. Needed that. I 
I'll have to get these guys a, a cell or something. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Close it up for now. I'll give it a chance for that. Ow! Dang it! Dang it! Really? Still getting me. Okay. We're out of here. We are out of here. Oh, wow, them things are mean. Mean, mean, mean. Well, yeah, the bees are friendly, but man, those yellow jackets tore me up. Oh, it hurts. My leg, my ankle.